Hello everyone and welcome back to another daily tutorial video, and as you can see, something is a little bit different this time. I'm on my phone. Why? Well, because today I'm going to be showing you how to get Java Minecraft running on your phone. So, let's get this started. The first thing you want to do is go over to your browser. I recommend watching this video on a computer and doing the actual steps on your phone so that it's actually easy to do, otherwise this is going to be very complicated for you. You want to go over to search or type URL and you just want to copy the link from the description of the video and paste it in. You will get to this page and you want to click on app-debug right here and click on details. And as you can see right here we have the app-debug.zip that is currently downloading and it's going to take around 40, 40 seconds to download so I'm going to be back once it is downloaded. So, as you can see, it is now downloaded, so all we want to do is go back to our home screen, and you want to go over to your file manager, and I'm just going to be using this one, and here you'll have appdebug.zip. So, all you want to do is just click on it, and click extract, select destination folder, and it is going to start extracting, and here all you want to do is just click replace, and it does show up, it won't show up for you, most likely and click on the app-debug.apk and install. So now what we're going to do is go over to this page right here and here we have the Amethyst or Angel or MC application. And we are now going to go inside of it, click on add account and add Microsoft account. For this step you do need to have Minecraft already purchased, it will not work without this. So please go ahead and purchase Minecraft. And as you can see right at the top here, we have my Minecraft in game username as well as the head of my Minecraft skin. So now what we can do is go right over here to this edit button. And if you scroll down, you have a bunch of different arguments and stuff. You can do a lot of different stuff here. As you click on save, it'll save it. And right over here, we also have a settings button. Where we can change miscellaneous settings, experimental stuff, Java tweaks. Here, we can also change the amount of RAM we allocate in Minecraft. So, if you have a better phone, you can allocate more. And allocate a little bit less, actually. And, once you're here, you just go back to home. And, you can just click on play. Or, go into here and create a new profile and play whichever Minecraft version you want. And... You can just play the game. So I just launched the game in 1.7.10 just to show you that it actually works. And as you can see, this is what it is going to look like. You can enable a mouse so it looks really cool and stuff. And if we go into multiplayer, this tab right here, we can even add a server and play on it. So yeah, that is how to play Minecraft Java Edition on your phone. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful in any way, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.